Hello and welcome to our Man's Life European Championship preview with me Shivan Shah. Today we're talking about Germany and if they can erase those horror memories of the 2018 World Cup and give their manager Joachim Löw the perfect send-off in his last tournament with the team. Let's start off with our three-word preview for Germany. And unfortunately for you German fans, it's first round exit. Germany just don't have that good of a team right now. And they lost 6-0 to Spain and 2-1 to North Macedonia recently. Also, they're in the group of death with heavy favourites France and Portugal. And they just don't have the depth or the quality to compete with the top teams. So in Euro 2020, it's another first round exit for Germany. Let's talk about how Germany is going to line up at Euro 2020. They'll probably play with a 4-3-3 and in goal you've got your sweeper-keeper Manuel Neuer and your two centre-backs are Antonio Rudiger and Mats Hummels. Then the full-backs are really a position of weakness for Germany and they don't really have any standout options. So at left-back we put Ruben Gosens and at right-back you've got Lukas Klosterman. Things do get more exciting in midfield where you've got world-class players like Joshua Kimmich at the number 6 position Alongside him, you've got Tony Cruz and Ilkay Gundogan, who enjoyed a renaissance this year under Pep Guardiola. Then you have your front three, where all three players will probably be very fluid and they'll interchange throughout the match. On the left, you've got Leroy Sané. On the right, you've got the guy who scored the winning goal in the Champions League final, Kai Havertz. And up top is Serge Gnabry. In terms of the most important player for Germany, from a tactical and leadership point of view, it has to be only one person and that's Yuzua Kimmich. Kimmich is the heart and soul of this Germany team and he really dictates the tempo of how they play from that deep-lying playmaker position. Now Kimmich has an absolutely incredible passing range and he averaged nearly 9 progressive passes per match and had 14 assists for Bayern Munich in all competitions. The one player to watch out for is the next wonder kid to come out of Germany and the youngest goalscorer in the history of Bayern Munich and that's Jamal Musiala. Musiala is the youngest member of this Germany squad and he had 6 goals in only 7 starts for Bayern Munich last season. He's an attacking midfielder who plays a bit like Delhi Alley, and he could have a great impact for Germany this year off the bench. Now that's all we have for you regarding Germany's hopes this summer but stay tuned to Man's Life for a lot more exciting content throughout the European Championships.